If you're looking to perform a clean install of Apple's latest operating system or simply need to install on several machines without having to re-download multiple times, then fortunately creating a USB install drive is a simple process. And in this video, we'll cover the entire process step by step. To complete this process, you'll need a spare USB thumb drive. 16GB in capacity is recommended. Note that it will be wiped during the procedure and obviously ensure your system is backed up beforehand. To begin, head into the Mac App Store where we can search for Catalina before proceeding to download. Alternatively, if you are running Mojave already, the download is directly available in System Update 2. Time taken will depend upon the speed of your internet connection, so allow plenty of time for the download to complete. Once the download completes, the install window will be displayed. At this point, simply exit the install and close the Mac App Store. Now we need to insert our USB thumb drive and then open Terminal, located within your applications and then within the Utilities folder. At the Terminal, command prompt type sudo followed by a space. Next, open a Finder window and navigate to the Applications folder, then right-click or Control-click on the Mac OS installer and select Show Package Contents from the drop-down menu. Navigate into the Contents folder and then into Resources, and here we find the Create Install Media file, which we drag into the terminal window. Next to this, we type dash dash volume followed by a space. And now with the Finder window active again, in the top menu bar, select Go and Go to Folder and type forward slash volumes, then click Go. You'll find your USB drive listed here, which you can now drag into the terminal window too. And that's our command complete, so hit enter in the terminal window and proceed to enter your system password. Type Y and press enter when prompted and the command will create your bootable Catalina installer directly on your USB drive. This will take a few minutes to format the drive and then complete the transfer, so best to leave it running in the background. And that's it, your USB installer drive has now been created. For a clean install, restart your Mac and hold the option key as soon as the system starts to boot. Select the disk called Install Mac OS Catalina in the drive list and you can now format your internal disk and install a fresh copy of Catalina. Note that if you have a newer system with a T2 chip, you may need to restart while pressing Command and R and then select the Startup Security Utility under the Utilities menu before allowing booting from external media.